Game time. What's up, guys? Uh, who we got? Shout team? Shout team, yes, sir. Fred. Go, boy. Go, boy. Flounder. Good to see you. Good to see you. Good to see you. You guys ready? Hey. So we've got one. They've just been told to get in order of their F3 names. Shredder on the far end, form this line down there. All right. You've got to be in the same order when you get down Leave there. Leave a rock. Go. Leave a rock. You two in the blue. All you guys, turn around. Let's go. Hurry up. Face this way. Come on. Face this way. Everybody thinks it's all about corporal punishment. Not always. You all get in the front leaning rest position. Move. Let's go. Front leaning rest. Let's go. Here's what you're going to do. You're going to do what I call up down. <laughs> They're fantastic. Hey, you four, get in the line right here. Get in the line right here. Shoulder to shoulder. To Here's what you're going to do. They're called up down. Get your you're mask gonna on. Take yourself and you're going to go down to that right elbow. Then you're going to go down to that left elbow. Then you're going to come up on that right elbow. Then you're going to come up on the left elbow. And that's going to be one rep. Does everybody right. understand? All right. All right. Let's All right. practice it. Down. Down. Up. Up. Line. Excellent. Now all you need to do is stay down and you're going to go through that sequence together. You knucklehead are going to squat and you're going to do this until I ask you to stop. Alright. Why do you guys think these four Begin! You ready now? Down, sir. Begin! Back to the start point. Put the weight down. One. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. Oh.
Hurry up, hurry up. In that squad position. Get in the squad position. I'm going to give you one minute, one full minute, to make sure that all of your gear is lined up exactly like the others. Go! Water front! 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 You got your headlamp on the right, aye? Aye! Do it! Make sure you're all lining up for me. You check the middle people. Make sure Don't worry about it. Pirates do whatever they want. It's kind of their thing. Don't do whatever they want. Good teammates do what everybody else is doing. Based on the instruction set. Here's what I need you to do. Very simple. I need ten of them. That's one. Somebody lead it make it happen. You stay together. If you're not all facing the same direction, you're wrong. Let's try it again. Let's try it again. Face forward, starting, starting forward. Face forward. Going this way, turning this way. Back to it. To your left. Right first. Aye. Aye. No, it's our left. You're right. No, no. Listen to Kilo. Hey, killer. You think these guys down here can hear you? No. Get your butt in the middle, please. Maybe you should use your pirate. Hurry up, hurry up, hurry up. We don't have all day. We're turning left, you are left first, all right? All right. All right. Starting position, move. In Kata. tell many of you are younger than I. I almost find no excuses for you folks who are younger than I not to be kicking ass like I do. It's inexcusable. That's where I'm coming from. I believe teams are the most powerful thing in the world besides love and friendship. And so today we're going to have all of them. Friendship, love, and teammates. All right. All right. All right. Let's kick ass. All right. All right. All right. Cadre's red. I was in the 
Army for nine years. I was an infantryman in a Green Beret. I commanded an ODA, Operation Desert Storm. I'm really happy to be out here with you, man. I'm really glad that despite these difficult times, that you guys still want to do this. I think it's freaking awesome. Thanks for having us out here. I'm Cadre Seabass from Kansas City. I was with the 75th Ranger Regiment, 1st Battalion, 10th Mountain Division. Spent time in Afghanistan. Run glory. I had four IED explosions on my feet. I feel privileged to be here, literally. And I'm very honored and privileged to be here tonight with you guys to have some fun and get a few things right. Does that make All right. sense? All right. All, right. All, right. all right. We got three cadre in training. We're going to be with us all night. They got the same power and authority as the rest of us. They're learning how to do this so that we can go forward and do more of these all at the same time. I'm going to have them introduce themselves now. Start with Major Payne. New. So I'm Major Payne. My real name is Jim Gregory. I uh, spent time in 3rd Special Forces Group. Deployed to Afghanistan and Iraq. Commanded an ODA. Um, bunch of firefight. Um, now I, uh, I'm the intended, uh, at F3, the capital. All right. All right. All right. All right. All right. All right. Then he was in the Olympics. True. And I was in the Olympics. Minor detail. Yeah. yeah. Raise your hand if you're in the Olympics. One. Player. Uh, Play. Brian Riley. Uh, my nephew name is Klinger from Toledo. I um, spent uh, four years in the Army in the 101st Airborne Division. Just excited to be here, uh, learning from Dredge, Shredder, Seabass, and uh, continuing to um, you know, accelerate myself, but also F3 as a whole. So thank you for having me. All right. All right. All right. My name is Tim Carr, a.k.a. Bloodhound, a.k.a. Bloodbath. Bloodbath! Bloodbath! Uh, I spent some time in the first group, uh, 19th group. Uh, flew as a Federal Air Air Marshal for two years out in New York. Uh, I've been pretty active with our search and rescue out in California and here in uh, Georgia. Uh, F3 is awesome. It's changed. My outlook on a lot of things, there ain't nothing more comforting than being a member on a team, having that shield off and that man on your left and your right. Think about that tonight. All right. All right. All right. All right. Uh, let's swing around this end of it and make a square. I think we can hear better. Up your knees. Plank is a very nice basic right move. Here. Let's go. Why is it so hard? Gravity. Stiff in your core, stiff in your core, stiff in your core. Down. Push those heels back behind you, down towards the ground. It will still, it will stiff in your core. Up. Going to the left. Let's go. Down. Up. Nice if you guys could do planks and we can stop. Get your knees off the ground. Let's come right here. Let's go right here, right in front of me. Down. Come right here. Why are we walking? Up. Four. Let's go. Roll in. Down. Here. What's the four? Roll in on me. Up. Up. You all get in a plank position. You can stop. Come on, boys. Now, tell your buddy to your right to do a flank right. <laughs> you stare at the ground, you're not helping anybody. Down. Head up, knees off the ground. Down to play. Up. Back straight, knees up, head up. Yep. Go get out, get out. What are you waiting on? Every morning, wherever you're posting, get off your knees!
Everybody's gonna slow down. Come on, 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 Oh, wait a minute. You guys actually moved everybody oh, up front? Come on. Good job. You want to go to the pass? Come on. Up, up, up. One, two, three, up. Come on, come on. Come on, come on. Chuck Chattery, man, it's over. But I want you to reflect on it. I want you to think about what. 16. 17. 18. 19. 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, For the people I've introduced them to. <laughs> I got a consistent. Not go too fast. Hey, what's going on over there? I We need it right here. Right, nice. right, right on Stay out of the left lane. Get out of the left lane. Out of that lane. Out of that lane, guys. Well, they told Team Blue to come get the fucking thing. Yeah. Yeah, that? Way. Heard burglars. Hey, did y'all see Chestnut over there? Hell yeah, yeah, I saw him in the bushes. He's already probably taking a bunch of pictures. <laughs> Wait, 10 count. Hey, 10 count, hold up. Hold up. Find the belt loop. Get all that neck. Well, I'm going to say you get on that steel and let them go. Slow it, slow it, slow it. We don't want to stop. Steadier will be finished. going on in our country right now, the chaos, the uncertainty, that 
is not a game. We men do shit like this to get better. Right. And by doing so, we must go out into our community and lead. I mean, everyone took away some valuable lessons, not just out here, but what we can do at home, at work, at church, in our community, just being a goddamn better neighbor. We must lead by example in this chaotic world. Dark Helmet sat in the prayer earlier today. We don't know which way we're going, do we? We have to be the rock. We have to be the leader. There's a lot of guys that we all know should be out here with us. Hi. And those fucking logs and that steel and those bags were heavier because they were not here. I feel sorry for them because right now they're thinking about what the fuck we're doing. God damn, we got smiles on our faces. That's right. Hey. But these two guys I want to call out for fucking being pretty damn impressive. Chicken Little yeah. has only been with Life 3 less than three weeks. Yeah. Well, yeah. 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 What the hell was going through your head tonight? <laughs> A lot of stuff. <laughs> Are you that guy? I signed up two days ago. <laughs> Tony Molina, are you happy that you made the decision to come out with your brothers and have some fun? Uh, I don't know. I don't want to be here, but I think my brother's going to be out here suffering, and I want to be with him. All right. All right. All right. All right. All right. Guys, we got to go back and tell these stories. we got to wear our patches and our shirts with pride. we got to get more guys in this packs to come out and challenge themselves. God damn it, this country needs strong men like us, and it needs our brethren helping to make the right decision and leading us. Tonight was hell, and here we are. November is going to be hell, but we'll be here. And after that as well, and after that as well. So, I'm sorry if I was an ass and screamed a little bit, but I'm damn glad to be out here. And thank you guys. All right. All right. All right so that you would grow your ego, so you'd be motivated to do so, so you'd have the confidence and the confidence that's required to do so. The idea isn't just to make you a better leader. We hope, you know, we've done that as much as you can in, in 72 hours, but also to inspire you to grow your portion of F3. That's what it's all about. It's about headlocking guys, bringing them to workouts, interceding in their lives and making them better. I don't know if you guys feel this way, but for me, it was life changing. All right. All right. All right. What we try to do is equip you to be life changers. You know, the Christian way to look at this would be like when Jesus says to Peter, I'm going to make you a fisher of men. Right? It's not about what you did or what you're forgiven for. It's all in the past. It's about what you're going to do in the future. A fisher of men, a disciple. Same kind of idea here. If you're going out there looking for men who are sad clowns, men who are how they are now the way you were. But for you, it's a was now. That's what you were. And now you're different because something happened. You want to introduce that same thing to them. So that was our ultimate goal. I hope it's clear to you. It may not be clear to you right now, but over the next few days, next week or so, hopefully that becomes clear and motivates you to go out and do something with it. All right? All right. All right. All right. And I'd like to make fun of this cloth a little bit. Because really what it is, it's a little bit of stitching, a little bit of nylon, a little bit of glue, a little bit of hook and pile on the backside so you can stick it on your hats or your ruck. But that's all it is. Probably cost 35 cents to make. Probably cost a buck 10 to buy, maybe less. So when you try to place value on things like this, you always have to take a step back and say, all right, so what is it really worth? How much sweat did you guys shed today? DNA left all over the field. Nice. How much blood? How much tears? That's where the real value of these things come into play. 
And I can tell you, all the men behind me and many of you in front of me, whether you're law enforcement, anything that has a uniform, where you've had to go through some difficult time in order to get a piece of cloth, sometimes it just says Castillo or your last name or U.S. Army. Sometimes it says something like Airborne or some school you went to or maybe some unit that's important that you've been into. Sometimes it just says Grow Ruck, F3. The point is, when you end up placing those things on those uniforms, they absolutely become priceless. Right. Some of the most important things I've ever placed on my body were little tiny pieces of cloth that somebody handed to me or told me I needed to go buy in the commissary or where the hell I'd buy it, and so do my uniform. I have a uniform that has never taken them off. They're that important to me. So with that, congratulations, man. All right.